Hey, welcome back everyone. Uh, we're going to do a video on the shield spell. So, I'm going to first take a look at it up here. The shield spell is one of the last spells you get. Uh, it's only level 1 here. It says a 20 second cooldown, which is the longest cooldown in the game, uh, which is a big knock on it. The range is 5.5, which is fairly large. And it says the shield is best used when attacking with a huge army and gives you an enormous benefit in the pinched battle. Um, the shield icon over here says 450. So it supposedly appears to give your troops an added uh, shield of 450 life. So we're going to go ahead and actually just test it against my base first. Just to get a little uh, preview on what it's going to look like. So people want to know what the shield and the heal spell work together. Because one of the Facebook posts was a shield, heal spell, and sonic blast working well together. Um, we'll do something to set up like this right here with the paladin, and cannons, and pyromancers. Pyromancers are extremely strong, uh, higher level gameplay. So again, my shield is only level 1. My heal spell is level 4. So we're going to see how this works out. Uh, a couple cannons. You go use the shield spell. And you see it puts a shield around all the units. Put the heal spell with it. And now we've got little hearts around all the units. I do need to bring out a uh, Pyromancer. The cool thing with the heal spell is it actually takes away the flame, the burn damage, and the poison damage. So I'll put the shield up again. So, so it's going to take away the status effects, but it, I believe if they reapply them, um, it'll pop back on. Come over here and hopefully kill the mortar. Reuse the shield again. So we're running into a lot of issues with this um, spell setup of not having uh, a sword rain to attack the ranged troops over there. Pyromancers are doing a decent job of holding off all the enemy troops. We'll be able to put the shield up on our guys now. We're going to push a little bit forward. Not too bad. We have a full life um, hero. So we're not going to get anywhere near the gate, but uh, overall... You can see we've built up a decent size army now. It's a, a pretty fun setup to work with, but it, it's not very effective unless you're going to use a lot of scrolls uh, to clear out a lot because you don't have much DPS. You don't have much damage per second. Uh, you can't really hurt the buildings that much. You could sub out knights for instead of paladins and have more damage per second. Um, but I don't think that's going to make that much of a difference. If the duration of the, uh, the game clock was longer, like 3 minutes or 3 minutes and 30 seconds, then the shield and uh, the heal spell would be better. Because it allows you to build up a nice sizable army, and then you can go as like a huge, just like tank. Let's go in here and we use um, knights instead. And I believe you can actually even shield in the beginning, and the shield never wears off until they take the damage.
because you can see the shield's still on the cannons back there that haven't been hit. Need to bring out some pyromancers. Trying to touch as much as possible with that sonic blast. We saw last time, I need a lot of pyromancers up here to help um, take care of all the ranged troops across the way. You can see this setup already with knights is doing a lot better already, um, just in the first first minute or so. We've already pretty much got past past this section, this corner almost. Uh, but we're, ha we're struggling to build enough to get past everything over here. Because of the constant wave of troops that are coming out. We can call the troops and hopefully make them force their way over here. Should be better. But then now, all the new troops that are going to come out of the castle gate will eventually start just pounding away and all the guys that are walking, walking past that little uh, road barrier type thing to set up the curve. So you can see a couple pyromancers do pretty well against a firebolt cannon. The sizable pyromancer army uh, that's taking down things definitely looks really cool too. So you can see knights are always going to be critical for damage. They're going to help you go further in the base. We did uh, did pretty well in this this attack here against myself with this setup. We have a nice army there. You see if we just had, you know, 30 more seconds, we might be able to get to gate gates. We might be able to take it down. Uh, we just not enough time. So overall they are fun to play with. Uh, to me not very useful in actual gameplay when you're trying to win uh, because you won't have enough damage. It's really, really hard to make them work. Yeah. Uh, the shield spell obviously is level one, so I, I will test that out when I get higher. Um, that's going to be one of the last things I do level up and, you know, try that. So I do want to see all the spells when they're, like, fully maxed out. You know, heal spells level 4 right now. And then the shield spell, again, is level 1. So it does get, you know, a lot better as you level it up. So hope you enjoyed that video there. And I will do some raids against a, another opponent, an actual opponent's in the next video. So check that out as well. Thanks for watching.